Uh, my name is Louise Patch. I've worked in sport for about um, 10, 10 to 12 years, kind of mixing it around. Started off at the FA here in football, um, then moved to kind of Olymp Olympics and Victor's Games. And now I've kind of switched to kind of like the more the more TV side, broadcast side. So it's been sport for a very long time, mostly in football here when we stayed in, in various matches. I'm going to go with here at Wembley Stadium for the Olympics. It was the Olympic final uh, between Mexico and Brazil um, and it was uh, just that, that whole match there was incredible. Um, incredible match and just kind of being part of that was insane. And then kind of pulling off those, those um, players off the pitch ready for their medal ceremony. You kind of line them up in the tunnel and these guys are going for like gold and silver medals. It's kind of just an incredible experience that you're, that you're part of it. Sport is, is in a, on a huge platform, like ev anyone and everyone sees it, everyone's involved, anyone can get involved in sports, um, from kind of like your smaller kids to your, your granddad to, to anything really, it's, it's just a, a massive platform to kind of to make change. Um, everyone knows about it, everyone watches sport on TV, it's just, it's just, it's just huge, who doesn't, know, who doesn't know about sport basically, and so it's a career that you could you know, start doing at a leisure centre or you can do it here at Wembley, it's kind of just a, it's a, a massive platform to kind of work and do different, different options. Challenges in sport is um, oh, it's so varied. You've got so many different characters. It's not kind of you know, like you're dealing with the sports side, you're dealing with broadcast, you're dealing with media, um, you're dealing with security, you're dealing with accreditation. There's so many different elements that you need to pull together um, that can be quite uh, difficult because you're, you're the one that's basically pulling the event together, but you've got to pull all those different elements in and those different people. Um, so it can be really challenging in terms of those different personalities, uh, but it's also very rewarding because you're working with so many different people. The biggest thing for me is like get your experience. Like you know, you got your degree, but I've kind of I have my I got my degree, and it wasn't even kind of um, sport related. Uh, but I ended up getting a job here, and it just kind of took the chance um, for a role. Get your experience first, and then you're gonna then you're you are gonna get that job. Um, I mean, studying your degree at Wembley is huge. It's a huge platform because people will look at that and go, you know, they, they want, they want a, uh, a decent career. And kind of even having the FA on my CV made me step into other roles and get this conduct because kind of, it's a kind of a, a massive um, organisation company that people look at worldwide and go, you know, they've kind of studied there or they've worked there. And it's just a massive, like, keeps in the word platform, but it is a platform that you can step up and work in, work. People just know about it, basically. Just make your contacts. The reason I've kind of had this career that I've, I've done is just contacts, contacts, contacts from anyone on LinkedIn or people that you work with, people here around the stadium, getting your experience. Um, use that as, uh, use, just use your contacts to gain experience and then step into that world because I mean, with my career it's not been, I'm not go, don't go to recruiters now, I go to people who I know or they come to me. So um, contacts, contacts, contacts is a huge, huge thing for me and just get that experience. Amazing, kind of like you know, they're, they, they're young ones, but they're you know, they're nervous, but they're excited, and kind of we just had a briefing session. So the ideas that they came up with is what we, I'd already been doing anyway. Like we kind of talked about the FA Cup final and the pre-match entertainment and what they do, um, and the ideas that they came up with kind of is what we're doing already. So they kind of, they've already have an idea of what what they're doing essentially, because I kind of you know they're through the biggest thing is now with like social media. It, it's a case of that the, they've got so many more opportunities maybe that I had back in the day. Um, so the kind of the UCFB is a, a kind of an awesome organisation that you could, it's just use it as to develop yourself. It's just, I think it brings like really big opportunities.